big this win is, I mean, Southfield Christian is the team that everyone always had to go through in D4. Talk about the stepping stone. Um, so I knew we were going to have a tough game coming in. Uh, Southfield Christian, they always go to the Breslin uh, every year. So uh, we knew we had to come in focused and prepared. Uh, we played well throughout the whole game. I think we responded well to adversity and everything. Um, I feel that, like, we played our best basketball today, especially, like I said, responding to adversity. And then Andal first and then Breslin for championships. We just talk about, you know, eyeing that court and being able to play on that court to play for a championship and what that would mean to you. Um, it would mean good, especially uh, all, the, all the hard work that we put in over time and, like, having to deal with the pandemic. I feel like we like we work we work for this moment, we earned this moment, so it'd be a great experience for us. And it seems like no one has been able to figure out how to slow you down. I mean, you just talk about the type of season and playoff run you're having on top of that with the big game last game and tonight. Yes, sir. Um, I think that like I come into every game prepared, not uh, willing to take a back seat. Uh, just like I said, just getting more in the shoot arounds, getting my form ready. Uh, just coming in prepared at all times, and, uh, having having the mindset to win. And this last week's been a big one for you because you also got named the Mr. Basketball finalist. Can you talk about how much that means to you? Um, it means uh, a lot to me, uh, getting recognized by the state. Um, I think I'm one of the best players in the country, uh, but being recognized by my own state is pretty uh, pretty good for me. So I like to thank everybody that's voting for me or going to vote for me. And, uh, <laughs> I hope I win.